Um, this is more John 3.16. The blue leather Bible, the words of the world is cosmos. It's an app and harmonious arrangement or constitution, order, or government. And the second uh, definition is ornament, decoration, adornment. The arrangement of the stars, the heavenly host, as the ornament of the heavens. Yeah, mm -hmm. so basically that cosmos is going up my Israel. And then the elect of Israel has that. Mm -hmm. Because they're the ones who give the law, statutes, and commandments to govern the world. And yeah. that's the order. And the order is in our Corinthians. That's the giver. talking about is the world of the Israelites, right? Because his world is in his book. His laws, his ways, his statutes, his judgments is in his book and he gave it to the Israelites. So when he says world, he's not talking about uh, oikomen or oikos. He's talking about cosmos, which is a system. And his system is in his book. And the Israelites understand and the, only the Israelites can do this system perfectly. Alright? First Corinthians 11 and, and 1. Be ye followers, be ye followers of me, even as I am also of Hamasiach. Now I praise you, brethren, that ye remember me in all things and keep the ordinances as I delivered them to you. But I will have you know that the head of every man is Christ, and the head of the woman is the man, and the head of Christ is God. Yeah. So that's basically the ordinance of the Lord. Right. It goes down from the Most High to His Son, Yahweh Shai, from Yahweh Shai to the elect of Israel, from the elect of Israel to one third of Israel. All right, and that's where it stops for right now. All right, because two thirds, man, y'all, y'all don't want to hear shit. Y'all walk right past. You little fucking kids walk right past, doing all kinds of stupid shit, and that's why they got these police down here for you fucking kids. All right, because. Adolescent Jakes, the most I said that you guys are young, uh, uh, wild ass lions, man. Alright? Got one. What? Nehemiah, uh, 23. Said, and they said unto me, training that are left of the captivity, uh, there, 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 are in great affliction, and coach, the walls of Jerusalem also is broken down, and the gates thereof are burnt with fire. And it came to pass, when I heard these words, that I sat down and wept, mourned certain days, and fasted, and prayed for the most high heaven. I got a piece back what we're talking about, about the sins. This is uh, child verse 20 and 11. It says, Even a child is known by his book, by his doom, whether his birth is pure or whether it is right. Yep. So the most high, even as a child, you know what you're doing is right and wrong. That's the Bible, so, you know what I mean? You know when you're out here doing things that you're not going to do, you know. You can finish doing it anyway, because your mom's not correcting you anymore. Here at home, not the rest of you at home. Right, with all the things that's about to happen, like the dollar collapse, the implement of the art by Egypt, the martial law, World War III, the, uh, uh, America invades Iran, and that's where Russia's going to get involved. Mm -hmm. So uh, basically, Russia has an alliance with it. Yeah. And then Titus going to get a life with them and all these nations, so they're going to they're gonna turn on America, which is the place of everyone. Yeah, yeah. Which, which proves the scripture.